Hey, hello, my friends. Hope everybody is doing well today. Eh, a little chilly this morning. It's November 3rd, 4th. <laughs> Gosh, probably about 40 degrees out there in Raleigh, North Carolina. Hey, I want to uh, really quick talk to you about uh, if you're a Chromebook user, and even if you're not a Chromebook user, you've probably heard of this uh, new Chromebook Plus. Um, I'm going to be real brief with this. I'm only going to give you one or two things that are that are there for Chromebook Plus. There's other options like screensavers and, and all sorts of um, stuff with the screen or it, it, it just shows you what time of day and stuff is there. But I want to show you these few little options here concerning um, when you're using uh, programs like Zoom, uh, Google Meet, and other um conference, uh, online conference, uh, stuff like that. Um, so there are new Chromebooks that are actually labeled Chromebook Pluses, which they have more memory and uh, more RAM and a beefier operating system, basically better display because it's a much more powerful operating system. But if you have an existing Chromebook, and I will have all these links below, and before I forget, <laughs> Please subscribe to my channel and uh, like this video. Um, 1,127, I think I've got so far. Thank you so much for every one of you guys and gals. Thanks for hanging in there. Okay, so let's get back to the why you're here you could go out and buy a new chromebook chromebook plus chromebook that's a mouthful or if you're having any, <clears throat> or there are about 30 chromebooks existing chromebooks that are out there that are eligible and will automatically update to chromebook plus uh, that's the 118 um, chrome operating system on the chromebook once you hit 118 in 118 somewhere there's so many versions of 118 but somewhere in there if your chromebook is able to run chromebook plus then you'll automatically have chromebook plus and how you tell that is when you reboot your chromebook you will see chromebook plus come up when you first reboot it and i will try and have a screen uh, a, a screen of that if i can get it off of my chromebook so let me show you uh, some of the operating systems. And again, I will, um, not operating systems, some of the existing Chromebooks that will be able to operate Chromebook Plus. <laughs> okay, I will have this link um, <clears throat> in the comments, um, in the description, I'm sorry. Gosh, it's early, I need more coffee. <clears throat> but you, it you know, tells you the CPU you need to have, you need to at least have eight gigs of RAM, which um, I've been using a Chromebook since, the day they came out, I've been using it 100% probably for the last, geez, I'd say probably the last five or six years. Um, I highly recommend you don't even look at Chromebooks under 8 gig. And um, what I recommend people to do is to get 8 gig, a touch screen, get as many options as you can, because you're going to be sorry if you don't, to be honest with you. And, you know, just the display. And here's all your different Chromebooks uh, that are eligible for the um, the Chromebook Plus operating system. Here is mine, the Asus. Uh, where is it? That one there, I think it is. The one I have I bought last April. It did not get raving reviews. It is a huge Chromebook. It's a 16-inch screen. I like it. Um Everybody said, oh, the display is awful. Oh, the display is fine for me. Um, I'm not real anal with uh, pixels and everything else. Um, they said it was, wasn't was bright enough. It was too dark. It's more than bright enough for me. Um, but it, it wor worked good for me. I got it on sale at Best Buy last April for, I think, $4.99, which I was like, wow. I never really wanted to spend that much for a Chromebook. But then I spent $300 and change for the previous Chromebook. And I'm really happy with this one. So I was looking at a cheaper one. And I thought, well, I could do without this option, that option. And I'm kind of tired of living like that. So I got this one and I'm really, really happy with all the options. 
backlit keyboard and everything. So here's all your Chromebooks that are eligible. And again, I will have this link down in the description of the video. But let me show you two or two or three really cool things that are, are available. It doesn't matter. Okay, let's go over to... Okay, this is Zoom right here. Hello again. And if you go down to your um, your bar down here, this is available no matter what you're on. If you're on um, Zoom, Google Meets, whatever else you're using, this pops up the minute you get on any kind of video call. So I can turn off my video. That is not within Zoom. That is within the Google operate uh, the Chrome operating system. Uh, here's something really cool. I can play around with the uh, background. You can do light, which a lot of people like. You can do full blur. You can turn it off. If, oh, you know, I don't like that lighting. You know, it doesn't make my face look really good, whatever. Um, you can change the lighting around. I have a light coming up. Oh, <laughs> coming this way, wherever that light's at. Over there. There it is. Um, I can make it like that. I can have noise canceling. I don't know. There's not too much noise. It's very early in the morning, but that's on, that's off. Um, and it tells me what apps I'm using already. Let's go over to um, Google Meet. I think it stopped for some reason, uh, but let's start a new one here. Same thing. We're going to go to Google Meet. Um, I don't use Google Meets too much. I really should probably move over to Google Meets because um, it's pretty much free and, and you can do a lot with it. I've been just on Zoom forever. I need to look into this. It kind of runs better on the Chromebook than Zoom. At least it used to. I haven't used it in a while. So here we go. We can turn off the video. Same thing. Same options as we had before. But this is really cool. This... Um, I think this really opens the door up to a lot. It, 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 it runs a lot better. It's a lot cleaner, I think. Same thing with the noise reduction. Uh, I can do the lighting thing. Same thing. Actually, I kind of like the camera, the way it looked with the uh, zoom, but it's okay. I'm not looking for anything fancy. But that is, um, let's get out of See, enough on my ugly mug here. That's one of the cool options I like about the um, the Chromebook Plus uh, operating system, 118 on your Chrome operating system. And like I said, there's other options. Just look it up. If you Google it, there's a, a lot of other videos showing you what you can do with, this, with the, the screensaver and stuff. And there's some other options that, honestly, I, I really don't use. Um, you know, I use it for work and stuff. I don't really play games or anything like that. But um, that's a really neat option, uh, th those options. And there'll be more to come as we, um, or as uh, Google gets the, uh, the OS figured out more. I haven't heard any real issues with it yet. I know the performance is a lot faster. But then again, I'm not doing much with my Chromebook uh, as far as like gaming and, 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 and perform like really stressing out the operating system. Um, I do eBay and other online uh, venues and use it for uh, my part-time job um, and, you know, do uh, Google sheets and just everything in Google. I, I keep everything in Google. I don't use anything else, but um, like a Google prisoner, I guess, which I'm fine with. So um, like I said, I'm not real super, super heavy. I'm not really stressing out the Chromebook, but those two options I thought were really, really cool because it was outside of both uh, Zoom and uh, Google Meets. So check those, uh, check it out when you get it. Hopefully your Chromebook will be one of those 30 that are eligible for uh, Chromebook Plus. And if you don't have it, and if you don't get it, it's, look, I'll tell you, you don't need to go out and go, but oh gosh, I need Chromebook Plus operating system. Um, if you're, if the one you're using is doing what, <laughs> it's working for what you're doing, just keep on doing what you're doing. You know, I'm not one to go and get the latest and greatest, to be honest with you. I just wanted to um, update you guys and gals on some uh, Chromebook stuff. All right, my friends, you guys have a great day. Stay warm. Bye-bye.